Hi, my name is Amber and I will be discussing the grounds for opposing a trademark application. This video will explore two grounds for opposing a trademark application. Firstly, Section 59 of the Trademarks Act, which involves situations where there is no intent to use. And secondly, Section 61, which governs situations where there is a false geographic indication. Under Section 59, the registration of a trademark may be opposed on the ground that the applicant does not intend to use or authorise use of the trademark in Australia or to assign the trademark to a body corporate for use by the body corporate in Australia in relation to the good or services specified in the application. Meet Billy. Billy is the owner of the smoothie company Banana Smoothies Proprietary Limited. He has come up with a great idea for a new banana smoothie drink called Banana Rama. He lodges an application in the Trademarks Office for registration of the name Banana Rama as a trademark in respect of banana smoothies. Meet Jack. Jack is a wealthy businessman who owns a smoothie company called Yogurt Lover Limited. Jack is Billy's long-standing competitor in the smoothie business. Jack sees an advertisement of Billy's trademark application and also wants to name his banana smoothie Banana Rama. Jack decides to lodge a notice of opposition on the grounds that Billy does not intend to use the trademark. However, this will be difficult to prove as there is a presumption that Billy intends to use the trademark because he has registered it. Therefore, the onus will lie on Jack to disprove the presumption and establish that Billy never intended to use the trademark. In the case of Aston and Harley Manufacturing Co., it was held that in order to satisfy the element of intent, the applicant does not need to have an intention to use it in the immediate future for intent to be established. Jack walks into Billy's store and sees Banana Rama on the menu, used to describe the banana smoothie. Therefore, Jack will be unsuccessful in opposing the trademark on the grounds that there was no intention of use by Billy, as Billy has already implemented its use. The next ground we will explore is Section 61, where the trademark contains a false geographic indication. Under Section 61, Subsection 1, a trademark registration in respect of particular goods may be opposed if the trademark contains or consists of a sign that is a geographical indication for goods originating in a country, region or locality in a country other than that where the goods originated if likely to deceive or cause confusion. This is Sophie. Sophie owns a vineyard in Tenerfield, Australia. She has recently developed a new blend of sparkling wine and wishes to label it Champagne. Champagne is a type of sparkling wine produced from grapes grown in the Champagne region of France. An application for opposition of Sophie's sparkling wine to be named Champagne will likely be successful on the grounds that it contains a false geographic indication likely to deceive or cause confusion. The onus will lie on the applicant opposing the trademark to put forward evidence as to why Champagne is a geographic indication. In summary, a trademark application may be opposed on the grounds of no intention to use or false geographic indication. Created using Powtoon.